Well, today is gonna be a special day. Got up extra early this morning and hit the road. I am proud to say today we're in Hawkins, Indiana, and we're gonna be checking out the filming locations for one of my favorite shows, Netflix's popular, very, very popular show, Stranger Things. Now we're actually not in Hawkins, Indiana. That's the fictional name of the town where all of it takes place. We are actually in a small town on the outskirts of Atlanta, Georgia, called Jackson, Georgia. Oh man, the bell is going off. Before we get started looking at the filming locations for Stranger Things, uh, there's somebody I'm gonna go meet first. While I'm in Georgia today, I stopped by, you all may know him as Camo Dave, Oh, I'm on. Hi. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I stopped by to have lunch with Dave and have a chat before I actually make it to the locations. They're filming some uh, footage. I may use in a future video someday. Camo Dave's maybe, over there filming his letters, letters, letters segment. Like, man, yeah. Okay, Katie Rose or Katie Ray. Katie Ray, shout out to Katie. Give her a shout out. Shout out, Katie. Dave. Over here lives out and he's got a camp right over here in the Georgia Pine Forest. That's right. That's right. I'm living. I am living. It's good. Get back to nature. Live simply. That's right. So yeah. Yeah. Every now and then I hear guitar music. Kind of scary. I've had a fun afternoon hanging out with Dave, but we're going to shoot over to Jackson so we can check out those filming locations. So Dave, I want to thank you for having me. It's great having you here by Bama Mike. It's been great. I've enjoyed it a lot. I had a fun time. Um, we'll have to stay in touch. All right, absolutely. I saw the trailer for Stranger Things season three the other day. So I decided I wanted to come do these filming locations because it's gonna be a pretty hot topic. Both, uh, both season one and season two were well received. Most of the locations that we're gonna see today though are from the very first season of Stranger Things. Like you might recognize this building right behind me. This is the store Winona Ryder worked at. And after Will was missing, her phone blew up. She also comes into the store to buy, purchase a new phone. This used to be a drug store. It is not a drug store any longer. It appears that it is closed. But this is it. This is Millville's General Store. They have it all marked, blocked off now. There's obviously nothing inside either that or um, maybe they just got done filming season three. It looks to be the same on the inside. If you look, it's got that wood grain paneling there on the wall. And that's exactly the same as it was in the show. So not much has changed on the inside. It's just not open anymore. During season one, located right next to the general store, this was a Radio Shack. It's obviously no longer a Radio Shack because there are no Radio Shacks. But you could see that as a Radio Shack in the show. Now, we are in Jackson Square. You may recognize it from the show as this entrance right here acted as the public library in Hawkins. They used this as the exterior for the library, but they actually used the town's library, which is not right here in this area, for their interior shots. Right here across the street from us, this is the Butts County Water and Sewer Authority. But for the purpose of Stranger Things, it was used as the Hawkins Water and Sewer. Whoa. And in the show, you can see Joyce and Jonathan have a fight right here. Mom, will you get in? I, I, I need to get 
think? You just go on home. Mom, will you just get in, please? When the camera pans looking at Jonathan, you can see this pole right here in the background. It looks exactly like this, except painted white. Stop. Just go home, Jonathan. No, this is not an okay time for you to shut down. And then when the camera pans around to face Joyce, you can see, they have it blurred on the show, but you can see uh, this area right here of the grounds. Shut down. Oh, we have to what? deal with this, Mom. We have to deal with the funeral. The funeral? For, for, for who? For that thing back there? Right across the street from me here. It's Bradley's old tavern. This was Hawk Theater. They built a marquee right off the front of it here to show that it was the theater. And it had a giant H on the front of it and all kind of lights underneath it. And it's also where it said all the right moves on it. And they spray painted starring Nancy the slut Wheeler. It would have been right there. As Nancy sees the marquee and she heads to the alley, as she turns into this alley, you can see this rental solutions building right here in the background of that shot. Wait. And of course we have the infamous alley, the alley where Steve and Jonathan get into that big fight over Nancy. Right here, this is where they were spray painting it at. I didn't know you could spell. Princess. The shot was from about right here at this angle and you, you can actually see the corner of this air conditioner right here in the shot in that pole. Don't screw up like your father. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that house is full of screw-ups. You know, I guess I shouldn't really be surprised. A bunch of screw-ups in your Jonathan, family. I mean, leave your it. mom. I mean, I'm not even surprised Jonathan, what happened to your brother. It. I'm sorry, I have to be the Steve, one to tell you about the buyers. Their family is a Come disgrace on. to the entire... <laughs> This is Hawkins. I have driven about 30 minutes up the road and uh, well I guess you can all recognize this place when you see it. That's right we are at the location of a lot of season one a lot of its climax. Hawkins Middle School. I, obviously we're not in Hawkins but it actually still says Hawkins up here on the building where they had just finished filming season three. They haven't removed it yet. Here off to the back of the school. This is the infamous water tower that you can see in quite a few of the shots. Gymnasium and all, it's not open for us to be able to get inside. But this is it, this is where they filmed it at, right here. All of the scenes filmed inside of the school were actually filmed inside of here, not on a set. They filmed it inside of this building, even when it was supposed to be the upside down. It's so awesome that they haven't taken the Hawkins down off of it yet. There's a shot from the show from right here where there was a giant tree over here to the left that's now been cut down. You can see the stump of it right there. But there was a school bus parked here and right here in front of us there was a sign that said Hawkins Middle School. You can still see the indentions here and right there where the sign was placed into the ground and uh, there was a bunch of students and cars but the uh, all the boys rode their bicycles right up this path right here and obviously you can see the water tower there in the background with that same tiger on it that has not changed that is their mascot What's interesting is the clip shows the boys riding up the path towards us to get to school, but then the clip changes shots and they're putting their bikes up into a bike rack. Well, that scene is down here in this gap. We're gonna walk down there and see if we can match up that shot. That's weird. I don't see him. You can also see as they're coming up, there's a shot from right here where there's some kids right here on this concrete platform. And you can see there's even a couple sitting on that rail there. That's weird. Oh, sure. The bicycle rack where they parked their bikes was right here. I'm telling you, this wild's right. Probably just went to class early again. You see him get off his bicycle and start walking this way. You can actually see this patch in the ground where 
the concrete is tore up. You can see it in that shot. He's paranoid girth, he's gonna give him another pop. You can also see this building, which is painted a different color, and this building here, which is also painted a different color. I'm telling you, this wild's right. Probably just went to class early again. Yeah, he's always paranoid girth, he's gonna give him another pop. The camera was set up almost in this exact spot. That's the shot right there. That's the money shot. I'm telling you, this wild's right. As the bullies are picking on them, you can look a, a couple of quick seconds and you can actually see this outside wall here that's surrounding this door. You can see it in the shot. Midnight, frog face, or toothless. There is a shot of 11 coming right out of this door here. And you can see with the doors open that there's a this the paint going down the wall and everything okay remember if anyone sees us look sad if you look right across the way there you can see that giant open room over there that is the room where michael and 11 kissed at the end of season one right right inside of there uh someone like a You can tell that that's the spot by looking at the windows. And also right over here by where they had the sign, there's a little parking area. And at one point, Jonathan walks out of school and he sees Steve and Nancy kissing. And you see, this is right before Steve destroys Jonathan's camera. And there's a, a pretty good shot where you can see this alleyway between the two buildings. They had some kind of banner hanging off of this right here and right over here where my car's parked they had another sign up here on this that said hawkins middle school that is the exact shot <laughs> hey man you can even see right behind jonathan's head there is uh some rectangular glass windows well there are those same glass windows still there today I climbed up on a ledge here so I could see through the windows and you can see the gym there and the mascot logo here on the wall and of course the gym is where they filmed this scene. You're dead Wheeler. Dead! There is a shot right here where Jonathan and Nancy are talking in the hallway. He was looking at the board there on the wall and you can see the board and there's a piece of wall sticking out here. You can see those in the shot. Also watch for this brick bench that's sitting right outside the doorway here as he walks out. So I drove over to Hawkins Lab, but I couldn't get any closer than this. This is Hawkins Lab. That is going to do it for this episode. We started out having fun with Camo Dave and then getting to see all of the filming locations for Stranger Things, getting prepared to see Stranger Things season three. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I want to uh, thank you all for watching it. Please go down and click the thumbs up button. And if you've not subscribed yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button as well. Thank you all and I'll see you again tomorrow. I hope you have a great day.